Lord Shepherd. Like that thing. When I fly high jet and give me 15 seconds to just rhyme my sentence like a drop by left. Guys, can we give a big round of applause for Kenneth Fareed? Welcome to London. We're very happy that you're here, right here at Pro Direct. As an Adidas athlete, you guys are killing on and off the court. What does it mean to you to be part of the Adidas family? It's a great thing for our brand. You know, on the court, we got James doing his thing and basically in an MVP race with seem like Russell, them two going at it, and it's amazing to see, especially off the court. I do my little fashion thing, especially wearing Adidas. We got all these nice shoes out, the, the MMDs, the Ultra Boost, and of course the top shoe right now is the Yeezy, so that's great. If you had an opportunity to have dinner with any British personality, dead or alive, who would it be and why? The Queen. I want to have dinner with her, see how she thinks and stuff, like, and see how, like, how do you run a country? Now, as an athlete, a lot of people see you guys as heroes. And if you were to be a Marvel character, who would you be and why? Spider-Man. Uh, that's been my favorite character growing up. My favorite color was always red. So him in that red and black suit, I used to think I was Spider-Man all the time. Especially playing basketball, climbing around, going to dunk it. And... What do you think of Adidas' new shoe, Celos? What do you think of it? I like them, personally. Can't wait to get my pairs and throw them on, you know. And you're going to see them on the gram too soon, so it's great. Thank you so much for giving us your time. Guys, can we give a big round of applause for Kenneth Fareed? What does it mean to you to now be a representative of NBA across, you know, around the world? Growing up in the Caribbean, for me, I would have never imagined being in this position today where I am able to go talk to kids, share my experience about the good things and the bad things that happen from being a professional athlete and to be able to shoulder and support them and empower them. Out of everybody you've played with, or the best players you've played with, who would you say was one of the best ones you've ever played with and why? I grew close to Kobe. We share a pretty cool conversation that, that we're beyond the game of basketball. And uh, I'm very fortunate that I played with that superstar for, for three years. And I wish I had the time to play with other superstars more time. So you're an Olympian, you're a champion, you're an ambassador. You've now decided to go back to university, so you're actually at university now studying. <laughs> Why? So I'm on the quest to doing every single thing that's on my heart. So for me, going back to get a master's is something that is important for me. I love learning. I love getting to understand how to get better, how to do things differently, how to have an impact in the world. I'm looking forward to it. Why not get a PhD? You never know. But Ronnie, it's your birthday at the end of this week. Jeez. So we we wanted to do something really nice to celebrate you. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for your time here. Thank you it's so much. It's been awesome. Appreciate you guys. I'm on that cloud nine, I'm definitely not to read it.